In this video, we will go over how to register your Torque 5 and the steps to upgrade software with an update test demonstration. Go to the X431 Torque app and locate the login. Press New Registration on the bottom right corner to create a new account. Fill out your personal information and complete the CAPTCHA to create an account. Next, you will need to locate your serial number and activation code included in your product pamphlet. You can also see your serial number on the back of your VCI. Insert the serial number and activation code when prompted to activate your VCI. Once activated, you've successfully completed your account registration and can now download software updates for the Torque 5. Select all that you'd like and simply download them. Next, we will need to update firmware now that we have new software installed. We will power our VCI with this Ford truck. After connecting, the firmware update should start. Keep the VCI connected while the firmware updates. Once updated, your Torque 5 should be all updated and ready for auto diagnostics. We will now run a diagnosis demonstration with the Torque 5. Pressing the auto detect button will prompt it to decode VIN. All you have to do is select the make of the car. Today, we have a Ford truck. We will go to the diagnostic function and set the ignition to on. In the topology display, we will select Health Report to see what codes come up. In this case, we will clear DTCs after identifying codes. For more fault information, you can select PCM on the topology display. Once the diagnosis is complete, we have the option to email or print our findings by pressing Report. You can see the kind of information that would be available on the inspection report here. This includes client's information or shop information and the sensors or modules to make the diagnostic process easier. We will disconnect the scanner from the car to finish this diagnosis. We hope this video has been helpful. 